Hello students, welcome to NEMA Academy. In this video we are going to learn about symmetry and tessellations. Firstly let's learn about symmetry. Now, let's fold a paper and test the line of symmetry. 1. Take a rectangular sheet of paper. Fold it through the midpoints of opposite sides, about ab. Each part overlaps exactly to the other. It means the rectangle is symmetric about the line ab. 2. Again, fold another rectangular sheet of paper about its one of the diagonals. About AC. You will see that each part does not overlap with the other. It means a rectangle is not symmetric about its any of the diagonals. 3. Take a square sheet of paper and fold along any of its diagonals, say along AC. What do you find? Yes. The folds fit exactly to each other. So, it is symmetric about AC. In this way, we can check whether a shape is symmetric about a line or not. Look at the given figure. In this figure, the left part and right part of our body are identical. If we look half-half part separately, we find exactly the same facing to each other. It means out body is symmetric on the vertical line throughout middle of body. Similarly, look at the butterfly. It is symmetric on the dotted line. The dotted line in which the object is symmetric is called axis of symmetry. Let's look at the letter A. It is symmetric on the vertical line. Similarly. The letter C is symmetric on the dotted horizontal line. In some cases, we can find more than one symmetric line and in some cases, there will be no line of symmetry. It is called order of symmetry. Let's look at the flag of Nepal. Here there is no line of symmetry. Similarly, let's look at this arrow. Here you can see one line of symmetry. In this rectangle, there are two lines of symmetry. But let's look at this square. In this square there are four lines of symmetry. Also, let's look at this circle. There are infinite lines of symmetry. 